beautiful, isn't she beautiful? I can't tell you how many fans came up to us today over at Southwest University Park to say how much they miss baseball, and they're right. Baseball was missed here in El Paso after the 2020 minor league baseball season was canceled due to COVID-19. The El Paso Chihuahuas had gone 623 days in between games. The wait is over, though. The downtown ballpark back open at 70% capacity, just under 6,000 fans to see the Chihuahuas host the Albuquerque Isotopes. And they got to see the top pitching prospect in all of baseball on the mound, Mackenzie Gore, getting the start. And he found out real quick that this ballpark, well, it's a hitter's park. Totes touched him up for a run in the second, two more in the third. But Gore would settle in, retired the last seven batters he faced. Six innings, eight hits, three runs, and five strikeouts. Chihuahuas, they would get the bats going in the fifth inning. Gazoo Cado, the RBI single there, and then here's your go-ahead run, a wild pitch, and Cato scoring on it. Chihuahuas, a winner on opening day. Five to three is the final. El Paso is now four and three to start the season. And KTSM 9's Colin Deaver joins us live from Southwest University Park. Colin, excited that baseball is back, but what I'm really excited about is that we get to see this Gore guy pitch this season over there at the ballpark. And Andy, the best part about getting a, uh, the first game in 623 days in El Paso at Southwest University Park, they got a win, they got to launch the fireworks off out in center field, that's the best part of it, but you said it, Mackenzie Gore, the number two prospect in all of baseball. He will one day very soon be in San Diego lighting up the major leagues. Tonight he was in El Paso. Got off to kind of a rough start. Three runs that he gave up but he really came on strong as he continued and that's kind of the book on a lot of young pitchers is that they get going as they continue on through games. Here's the line on him. Six innings pitched, three runs, eight hits but he did have those five strikeouts that Andy mentioned earlier. His changeup was working. All of his off speed pitches were very impressive to watch. And Mackenzie Gore, like, it, that's almost a sign, Andy, of, of how good he can be, is that he can turn a day where he didn't really have his best stuff into a solid start. Six innings with those five strikeouts. Of course, the Chihuahuas get the victory to boot. So uh, met plenty more to come from Mackenzie Gore and the Chihuahuas. We have not seen the last of him here at Southwest University Park, I have to imagine. We have not seen the best of him at Southwest University Park either. So excited to see how he grows, how his career kind of goes from here. But again, the El Paso Chihuahuas, was getting that 5-3 to three victory, rallying late for that win on the first game in 623 days at Southwest University Park. It's great to be back. Everybody's excited. The fireworks are popping. Andy, I, I'm going to send it back to you. It's just, it was just a great night, Andy. Back to you.